welcome back to my channel. So today's video, this is Eve from later in the week by the way, which is why I look significantly better than I'm going to in the following clips, is a get productive with me. Basically, I have one week to do 10 books worth of reading, loads of like other admin things, YouTube things, life things. So I thought I would take you along with me and enjoy the productive ride productive ride. Before this video starts, I just want to say that this video is very kindly sponsored by Clean Fox, which I think is such a good idea and I'm so excited about this collaboration. So basically, it's an app that's available on iOS and Android and it's also a website and you download the app and basically what it does is it clears your inbox and gets rid of all of the spam emails and newsletters that you don't really want. This is so good for me because I have so much email clutter. I literally have like 20,000 unread emails and this has been on my list this week to sort out my email inbox. So you know me, I love being productive but I'm also really trying to make changes to help the environment which you'll see a lot in this vlog. So the best thing about Clean Fox is that it's also eco-friendly. So all you basically do is you log in and you connect your email and it doesn't like do anything with your personal data your personal data is completely safe there's loads of really good reviews and really positive feedback online and what you do is you select which ones you want to keep and then if not it will delete all of the emails that you don't need and you have a blooming beautiful inbox <laughs> having emails sat in your inbox actually requires a lot of energy so by clearing out your inbox you're actually reducing digital pollution which is a really important thing that i don't think is spoken about enough so if you want to check out Clean Fox, I will be sure to leave all of the links and everything you need to do that in the description down below. I'm really excited about this because it's a good way to be productive but also do your bit for the environment. So go and check it out if you haven't already and onto the video. First job is to unpack. As you can see behind me, I have so many parcels because I've got like events and people's birthdays and things that I've been ordering and like university stuff. So pl plan number one is to unpack my suitcases, unpack parcels and just put everything where it needs to be. And I'm not even going to think about packing for uni yet because I just need, I need to like sort. Okay, let's do that first. So I'm going to put some music on while I am sorting everything out because I feel like it's going to take quite a while. I actually got this from the Berlin Philharmonic. Oh my god, look at this. These are ratchet. Right, we're just... That is part of this video. I'm going to get my nails done. But um, I actually got this from the Berlin Philharmonic and it was quite expensive and I don't usually pay a lot for my vinyls. But this is one of my favourite symphonies and it's really pretty. And I thought, ooh, let's... Give a listen, give a listen, give it a listen. <laughs> unpacked everything i just have a couple of bits and bobs like on my bed next job is parcels a lot of them are um clothes or just like general things a lot of brand deal stuff because i've got quite a few brand deals to film this week so i'll do a little unboxing for this video real quick though because i'm really conscious of how long this video is going to be aha yes it's the answers to music theory in practice how exciting am i i'm basically gonna try try i can't believe i'm actually saying this on video try to actually do piano lessons this year so i've bought music theory just because a i find it really interesting and b i just i want to learn music theory because i feel like i used to know it i used to like i used to be like grade four grade five music theory and now i literally forgotten it all because i haven't done it in years so music theory oh my god there's so much in here ready set study student life can be tough so we've boxed up all the skinny dip essentials you'll need to get through the new term in style thanks skinny dip oh my god oh my god i'll take an instagram of that and put it on my story in a minute what is this oh this is a parcel for a brand deal which i'm not going to show you right now because you'll see them very soon but i'm very excited about this parcel fairy lights for my university room essential essential okay these are some heels because jamie my cousin is turning 18 in two weeks and um he's having an 80s theme party so i have bought myself um some silver heels because i'm going as baby from dirty dancing um and oh yeah i like those those are very nice i just thought like i would probably wear them quite a lot anyway so yeah that's that youtube girls are coming up to oxford for formal in like a couple of weeks time and i didn't really have like a, i don't have any formal dresses i've got loads of summer dresses but i've got none 
that I can wear for formal. We have quite a lot of dinners and stuff in the first couple of weeks and I've got quite a lot of balls and things. So I thought I would order some dresses from Topshop. So I've ordered these three. Um, I'm not gonna keep them all, don't worry. I'm gonna send the other ones back, but I'll try them on in a minute. Oh yeah, this is the music theory um, actual book. So hopefully I'll actually be able to learn this. That's on my to-do list this week to start that. Yeah, so I ordered a new bedspread because my room this year has got a bright red notice board which means that all of the bedding that I bought last year just clashes so horrendously that I had to buy a new bedspread. And I saw this one on Urban and I was like, it's perfect. So I got this cushion which says, bless this mess, because my room is always a state. So I thought that was perfect for uni. And then I also got the nicest bedding set of all time. I got this bedding set. It's the boobs and bums bedding set. I actually adore it. It's so nice. Oh, I'm obsessed. I am obsessed. Girl fucking power, right? <laughs> this is my skirt for the dirty dancing. I'm going to try this on in a minute, like, because I want to see what the whole outfit looks like together. But this was the closest skirt I could find. But I literally think this is perfect. Another one, a book. Bet you this is one of the university books that I've not read. In my defense, it's poetry. Poetry can definitely be read, like on the day and someone has actually <gasps> someone's annotated this with the vocab someone has annotated this one with the vocabulary whoever had this before me i actually adore you and it's water stained we love to see it oh my god another book another two books parcel bar one that i have is the body shop advent calendar big love to the gals at the body shop and mc sachi for sending me this i'm going to take this with me to university and we'll open it as a floor like we did last year job is to put these on instagram and put this on instagram so that's what i'm going to do now So I've done the boomerang, I've just done it, like, ignore this, I need to order a new phone case on my to-do list. Um, but I've done the boomerang, so um, basically if you get gifted something, you have to put hashtag gifted on there. Just done the second Instagram story, ready to go, so I'm just going to post that now. Yeah. I need to get a new top because this one is way, way, way too big. Um, not really that cute, but <laughs> I'm literally obsessed. Like Once I've got the top on and I've curled my hair... We out here, baby, from Dirty Dancing. Also, it's actually, like, not a horrible outfit. So, yeah, very excited. This And also, I will so wear this skirt just, like, anyway to, like, formals and stuff. So, so pretty. And I love the shoes. Big win, big win, big win. This is the first dress. I'm actually in love with it. It's so pretty. I need to um, get the straps, like, tightened because my boobs are not big enough to fill it. But, oh my god, I actually love it. I love the detailing on the side. I think it's really flattering. And for formal, this is going to be perfect. An annoying turn of events. I also adore the second one. Literally, it's a bit big because it's a 12, not a 10. Um, I usually get a 12 from Topshop in dresses just because sometimes they can come up really small. But And they didn't have the 10 in stock. But I literally love this. Oh my god, I'm taking all of these with me to uni. This is such a nice, again perfect for formal perfect for dinners i can wear one for formal one for scholars dinner and the best thing about these sort of dresses as well is that like unless my figure changes which is just not really going to now i'm good for life i've got nice dresses for life and i got 25 percent off as well so all three of these dresses came to 50 pounds for three dresses that's decent i'm dead i love this too though i love all three of them guys i'm gonna have to keep all three this has never happened before i usually buy three and then pick one but all three of these i'm gonna get so much wear out of um and i don't have any formal dresses so this is perfect <laughs> okay so my room is now looking a little bit more presentable this down here is stuff for university uh my desk is looking all right to be honest like it could be better but also it could be a lot worse i have no clue where to put the advent calendar um i've cleaned out all of the packaging that came with that delivery cycle i've put it all in the recycling do not worry like I don't hate the environment. My bed is more or less made. And then down here, I have my vinyls because I would usually put them on my desk. But I need my desk to work. Um, and then down here, I still have all of my A-level books and stuff. 
And I don't know what to do with those, so they're just still there after about a year. And then down here I have some stuff for brand deals that I need to film over the next two days. My rucksack and returns that I need to make. So, yeah. Looking good, to be honest. Oh, yeah, baby, you're going to the rag ball. The rag ball's basically a charity ball, so it's a bit more expensive than some of the other balls, but I really wanted to go to this one, so... Buzzing! Boop, boop, boop. Still looking very much like an egg, but next job is to write a to-do list for this week. So, like, I need to write, like, a really big, comprehensive list of things I need to order, things I need to get for uni, things I need to buy, everything. So that's the next job, because I feel like I need to put it all on a piece of paper so I can split my week up well. have ordered phone case, phone screen protector, new um, shoes for going out clubbing because I ruined my last pair and a portable charger because I threw mine into the Thames at Summer in the City. So yeah, okay, next job. I'm gonna figure out something else to do that's not academic because I'm tired. So I might, I don't know, I might just procrastinate because Strictly's on at 6.40 so. I feel like that's what I really want to do. Maybe I could start editing this video. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start editing this video. <laughs> Exception. I've just edited up to this point on the video. So we're doing good. It's now 25 past six. So I'm pretty much done for the day. I'm going to go and watch Strictly and then see you tomorrow, I suppose. Good morning, everybody. It's a really, really rainy, damp, horrible day today, which is perfect for all of the work that I need to be doing. So it's quarter to nine now. I did set my alarm for half seven, but I just... I don't know what is wrong with me at the moment, I just cannot get up, so I'm going to go and make a coffee and then start reading Don Quixote because I've got 100 pages left to read and I just want to sit and I want to read and I want to finish it before I do anything else today because it needs to be finished today. <laughs> So I recently bought this because I want to start using more plant-based products. I'm not like going vegan straight away, but I want to just start implementing like change into my diet. And I thought that milk was definitely one that I could do. So you guys told me to get the oatly milk. They didn't have the barista one in stock. So I imagine that would be better, but I'm going to try my coffee with this and let you know my opinion. <laughs> I've tried these, the Alpro um, yogurts. They're based on soy milk and I love these. I actually prefer these to normal yoghurt, so this switch has already been made. No more yoghurts, just gonna have these ones. <laughs> First job of today is to finish this. I've got 100 pages left exactly, so I'm literally just gonna sit here and I'm gonna finish it. So help me God, if it's the last thing I do today, this is getting done. <laughs> At the risk of being a basic bitch, this is the playlist that I'm currently listening to. Um, it's a very good playlist. 12 out of 10 would recommend if you're reading. Yeah, it's got some really nice classical pieces on and I enjoy, especially Vaughan Williams. We stan Vaughan Williams, he's so good. I don't even know if that's how you pronounce his name, but we love him. So I've bought in <laughs> some raspberries for sustenance because I'm going to fall asleep. Um, it's currently 28 minutes past 11. Um, so, uh, yeah, I've got two hours until we're going out for dinner. So I reckon I can finish it in the next hour and then have an hour to get ready to go out for dinner. And then go for dinner. Woo. I finally finished. It says 93%, but that's because of the notes. But I've done. I've done. It's finished. It's gone. Yay! <laughs> On a real level, it's such a long book, I genuinely feel like I don't remember any of it. Like, but I've got the general gist and I can always read a plot summary. Um, so now I'm gonna get ready because we're going for dinner. So I can't exactly go looking like this, can I? <laughs> Guys, it looks slightly different now. A little bit more presentable. Um, so I just went for lunch with my family. Um, didn't vlog that because I thought it was just lunch. I'm now, while I've got a little bit of makeup on, gonna film some Snapchat stories for a brand that I need to do, and then, and then, 
and then tidy my room and then maybe do some music theory i don't know i don't know if i'm going to carry on reading or do some music theory because i'm kind of like if i don't carry on reading i won't start again but also i'm not in the mood to do some reading right now so we'll keep you updated <laughs> I filmed the thing that I need to do for a brand video. Um, now I suppose I'm just going to take my makeup off because I'm not going to lie. It's sticking to my face and I'm just not really a fan. And then I'm going to quickly tidy my room because somehow I literally breathe and my room gets dirty. Like I've literally done nothing today other than read a book. But go off I suppose. But yeah, makeup is going off. <laughs> just made an oat milk latte it doesn't look very appetizing because i've started drinking out of it but it tastes literally just like a normal latte like this is actually so delicious <laughs> and i made it without even having a proper coffee machine like all you have to do is microwave the milk or heat the milk up on the hob use a cafetiere like a french press to froth the milk and then put it in your espresso and then bam and okay the oat milk does have a slight aftertaste so i am going to buy some soy milk and see if i can see which one i prefer but i actually really like this like i'm very impressed <laughs> so next job is going to be to do some music theory because i have finished don quixote i have done my brand deal for today that i needed to do um so music theory is the next thing that i need to do an hour of music theory like i do i get it and i know that it's just like learning a new language and that like it will become easier with practice but yeah anyway so i've done an hour of that i've done like the first sort of chapter now i'm gonna go and read this shepherd book for until strictly results basically which is two hours will i focus for two hours probably not am i gonna try absolutely am i gonna finish it absolutely not but we move I'm cold um so that's why I look like this maybe if I like dress like a shepherd because they wear like this don't they then I'm channeling the vibes of the shepherd novel I don't even know how much more I've got left to read but I'm definitely not going to finish it in two hours so I don't know really who I think I am but we'll give it a go So I just read like, okay, I didn't do two hours of reading, I'm not gonna lie, but I actually realised that the book is a lot shorter than I thought, like I've nearly finished it, so yay. Um, so I have finished that, um, I finished five out of the seven books, well, there's like seven mini books, but there's only 20 pages left, which I can so read tomorrow morning. Um, so I am gonna do some more reading later tonight, but right now I need to put a screen protector on my phone because I took mine off yesterday and it's just a risky business to be to be living to be honest so next job is screen protector I don't know why I'm telling you about screen protector my phone is now all protected and you literally can't even see if I'm not in focus but you know what let's mix it up let's have a slightly out of focus clip next job is to go and watch the Strictly Results show but I'm gonna do a workout like I'm just gonna go on the exercise bike while I'm doing it just because I could redo with a bit of exercise and by a bit I mean like lord help me I look awful so <laughs> let's go so this is what I'm wearing it's this top from Peru it's like a football top basically but you can see it says Peru um my leggings are from Nike my trainers are also from Nike uh, OTD okay just finished exercising oh my god I realized I just didn't take my earrings out that's really poor um, just some exercising and watch Strictly. Now I'm going to make myself a snack because I didn't have dinner because I had like roast dinner at like two. So I'm going to make myself a snack and then go and do the rest of my to-do list. <laughs> so I've just made myself some like pit not pitta, um, wraps because we've run out of pitta and some pepper and a bit of hummus. Red pepper hummus of course, of course. <laughs> so I've just got out of the shower. I literally did everything. Hair mask, done my face. Oh my god, still not taking my that is such a like i don't usually do this i'm sorry i am going to take them out in a minute um now i need to sort out all of my a level and prelims stuff because it's going up in the loft i've bought some boxes to get rid of it out of my room and to make room for finals stuff so that's what i'm going to do now call me 
me sentimental. Like, I just want to keep all of my A-level and GCSE stuff. Like, this is everything that I still have, I think. I think I might have some folders up there, which I'm going to try and get down here. But I know that, like, I could just get rid of all of this. But I feel like when I've got my own house and I've got my own attic and stuff, like, this is the sort of stuff I want to be able to look back on. So, yeah. And also, my sister might be able to use a lot of this because she is probably going to do similar A-levels to me. So possibly my least favorite job but really needs doing is washing my makeup brushes <laughs> done 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 and dusted now to write a to-do list for tomorrow hey guys so today is monday i have an appointment in half an hour so right now i'm actually going to go through a brief for a video that i need to film when i get back and like go through the brief and get all the key points and just sort of get an idea of like what I need to be doing because I was going to start reading but realistically I need to leave in half an hour and I feel like I may as well just do something else because then I can get the video filmed quicker when I get back so. I don't lie, I have been watching these guys for the last half an hour, they're actually so funny. Um, I think they're both professional violin players, I'm not entirely sure but like they're actually hilarious like Hello, welcome to another they have so many funny videos um, and I think that they may be my new favourite people. <laughs> Just so you guys know, I've been having oat milk in my tea and I'm converted. Like, it literally tastes exactly the same, if not nicer. So, yay for that. <laughs> okay, so, I now have the brief all ready to go. Um, my skin is really bad. I don't know what is going on here, like, what this situation is. Um, but I'm going to go into town now. It's, like, 9 o'clock. So, hopefully, I should be able to get parking space. And going to go get my nails done, hair removed from my legs. Just generally sort myself out. <laughs> I'm back from town. I've just gone and got like a few little bits. Not everything. I'm going to do a proper shop for uni in a couple of days. But I just had to get like a bath mat. Just general tidbits. A shower caddy. Things like that. Because I've actually got a bathroom to myself this year. So that's basically what I've just done. Got my brows done. They look so much better. I literally... But the woman was only trained in lower leg waxing. So I've now got to try and do my the rest of my legs by myself. If you guys have got hair as dark as mine. Bearing in mind my hair everywhere on my body is this dark. Everywhere. You guys know the pain of hair removal. I literally, it's just a constant battle. But I got my nails done as well. I just got like a red tea colour because it's autumn. Now I'm going to quickly eat some lunch and then I've got to film a video and it's due in at three and it's half one. So love that for me. <laughs> so I had almond milk in my latte. No, cappuccino. I mean, I'm literally buzzing off caffeine right now because I haven't really eaten today. But it was so good. It was like having a bake well, but like coffee. I actually preferred it to a normal cappuccino because I didn't need to put sugar in it because it's sweet enough. I've bought some soy milk actually to try later so then I've hopefully tried uh, oat, almond and soy so I'll give you my opinion on that later. So absolute bans. I've just got a package from um, school. I've not been into school for like a year now. Well I've been in but like, I've not like so I don't know what it actually is. Okay so I got one for being deputy head girl. Love that for me and one for exceptional results and progress at A-level. Well, thank you to my school for that. Um, oh my God, there's a whole program. Cute, cute, cute. I'm actually like sad. I miss school so much, I'm not gonna lie. I do not know what has happened. My laptop ran out of storage and like that's never usually a problem. I usually literally just delete one of my old Final Cut libraries and it moves on. My laptop is just, it's completely spazzing. Nothing is loading, like it's, everything is frozen i can't get into my final cut pro libraries it says i've got no files like i literally don't know what to do i'm <laughs> every time i try and open a library it's like permission denied but i'm like why are you denying me permission so i'm a bit fucked now i have so much to be doing ah! i've literally just had the most stressful hour i lost all of my footage and i was i, I literally have been crying for the last hour because I lost so much footage and it wasn't like I haven't backed it up. Of course I've backed it up. There's something on the lens. Basically, I lost all of my footage <laughs> and I was literally panicking like my laptop and then all of a sudden like I was literally sat sobbing and my mum was like, I don't know what we're going to do. And then my laptop just restarted itself and it all came back. I don't know what the fuck happened but now I'm just really stressed. I've got a really bad headache now because that has just sent, that literally sent me into like complete overdrive because it was a whole month's worth of videos so i'm now stress eating toast i'm going to order a chinese later because i feel like i just need food and um, yeah i'm going to finish editing this video and then probably have a nap or do something kind of relaxing and then try and get some reading done this evening bloody hell <laughs> So I've just edited and exported the videos. Um, I'm like two hours behind where I want it to be. 
but we move anyway i've decided to order a chinese for tea i am trying to eat healthier but like today has just been stressful and i don't know if you guys are like this like if i even have the slightest bit of stress i just need a lot of carbohydrates so i'm gonna order that in like three or so hours i'm not really that hungry at the moment um but i'm just going to read the second book um of the shepherd section of my paper so i've i finished the first one in costa this morning and i really do just need to bite the bullet and read the second one it's really i feel like it'll be more interesting when i'm studying it but right now it's just boring um but i'm gonna sit and read this for a while with a bit of music on in the background i've got another cup of tea oat milk tea honestly i've com just completely going to cut out dairy now i need to get some dairy free butter um because i do lactose sometimes but other than that I feel like dairy is now just not really going to be a part of my diet that much, which is good, you know? <laughs> I've been reading for a bit. I've actually done quite a lot of reading. Um, I'm now eating a Chinese, which I'm not going to show you the full size of because it's actually quite embarrassing, and watching Gilmore Girls. Okay, you can kind of see the full size of the Chinese. It's been a long day, <laughs> um, and I've not had a takeaway in ages, so allow it, please. <laughs> I'm going to stop packing, but I'm not going to vlog that because it's going to be a whole separate video, so stay tuned for that. <laughs> It's called fashion. Look it up. <laughs> I'm just wearing something really chill today because I just really need to get like quite a lot of reading done. So I'm just sat in my conservatory at the moment and I've made myself an iced latte but with unsweetened soy milk. I don't know if I'm going to be the biggest fan of soy milk. Not for any particular reason. I just don't like from what I remember I don't like it very much but we'll give it a go. Not going to lie. Either I'm being stupid or... Tastes pretty much the same as a normal iced latte. Fabulous. I actually really like that. Okay, so that's three out of three plum milks that I've tried that I actually quite like. I feel like oat milk in an iced latte would probably not be that nice. Um, I will try soy milk in a hot coffee because if soy milk works in a hot coffee, then win for me. But now I'm literally just going to sit and finish this book. Um, like, I'm just going to sit and do that. That's all I'm doing because I wasn't very productive last night, so... <laughs> To counteract the Chinese that I had last night, I have a plant laced yogurt and some blueberries, so that totally counts. <laughs> undoubtedly skim read a lot of that book but to be honest it's a lot of the same it's a lot of shepherds being sad that they've been pied by somebody else so i finished yay okay so i still have one more spanish book and two more german books to go but right now i'm not gonna do that i'm gonna sit and do some music theory um because i didn't get to do any yesterday so i'm gonna sit and do that for an hour and then Maybe make a start on the next book. I don't know. I'm just kind of playing it by ear today. I've done an hour of music theory. Um, I actually like... I do get it. It's kind of like learning a new language though. Like you, you kind of... You get more instinct about it. Like... I can read music, I can read music, but like not very quickly, if you know what I mean. So like I have to look at it for like a good fat few seconds a lot of the time before I get it. But we're getting there. I'm just going to make myself some lunch now because I'm hungry. Yeah. You didn't need to know that, but I told you anyway. It's gone so dark because a thunderstorm is about to hit, but I've just made myself some lunch. It's a really basic pitch lunch. It's just salad, sweet corn, pepper, and then these vegan um, five grain fillets, which I literally love so i've cooked one of those and then just waxed it all in a salad and covered it in sweet chili sauce which completely negates the nutritional value of it but <laughs> we're here for it so now i'm just going to watch um some youtube and stuff um and then i have a couple of little admin bits i'm going to do and then i'm going to get on with reading now we're on to galatea by cervantes how fun six books are you joking me <laughs> god i'm not gonna be able to finish all of these so i read 30 pages and then fell asleep for an hour um sometimes it just really be like that um, i'm gonna go 
get ready now and then go out and film with V and then I'm going to spend the evening editing because I need to edit this video and edit that video with V and edit a couple of videos for Cherwell so I'll pick you up again not tomorrow because I'm in London on Thursday so I'm in London with Liv tomorrow so that's not going to be part of this vlog and then Thursday I'll be back and I've got three books left to read. I'm probably going to try and finish two. Because let's be realistic, I'm not going to finish all three. But I do have all of Freshers Week to, to read another one. So, yes. <laughs> hey guys, so it's now Thursday. It's half past two. No, it's not. It's 20 to three. And I've just got back from London. I went to go and see Tchaikovsky at the Royal Albert Hall with Liv. It was such a nice day. Or like, But today, I won't lie to you, I am an anxious mess um i generally am a lot better than i was like this time six months ago but today i'm just feeling really really anxious for no reason like i have no reason to be anxious um i got an essay question sent through earlier which i don't really understand and that didn't really cause me any anxiety so i'm not entirely sure what it is but anyway i'm basically just going to turn my phone off um and just try and get some stuff done uh yeah i'll keep you updated How cute is my new phone case? It's Yoga Ladies from Skinny Dip. Skinny Dip do the best phone cases, but I'm literally obsessed. Sorting out my purse right now because I have so many cards and stuff that I need to sort, so that is the next job. <laughs> next thing I'm gonna do is put everything onto Apple calendars because I'm, I am increasingly relying on reminders and things, and I feel like having it on Apple calendars, which is then synced across all my devices, is gonna be easier than literally just setting myself reminders every 10 minutes, so. <laughs> So this is October, not too busy yet, but it will fill up when I have my timetable to do classes. But we still don't have a timetable because we still don't have the lecture list, RIP. <laughs> Good morning, it's Friday today. Um, sorry I didn't really vlog much yesterday. I literally got back and then I did do I did do a fair bit of stuff. Um, and then I finished reading half of Eric, which is a book. And then I started packing and then that just took a lot longer than I thought. And then me and my mum ended up having a chat and... Basically, I didn't really do that much yesterday of value. Um, but today is Friday. Uh, it's my last real day to get stuff done, the last day of this vlog. So today I'm going to finish Eric this morning. And then I have lots of YouTube little bits to do. And then I'm going to see my cousin Jamie for lunch. And then this afternoon I'm going to try and read as much of Galatea as physically possible. I'm not gonna finish it, but then if I do that, I've read all but one book and I haven't read the poems, but as I said, the poems are definitely something I can do like when I get the essay set, so. Woo! <laughs> uh. Finished, yoot! Thank God, okay, so that's eight out of 10 books done. <laughs> hey guys, I look it like this because I'm about to do my makeup to film like a YouTube video, um, so that's why I look like this. But I am going to end this video here because it's currently Friday lunchtime. I'm going out for lunch with Jamie after I have a video conference call with the chairwell, which is the student newspaper. So a video conference call, going out for lunch with Jamie. I'm going to come back, edit all of the other videos that I've not finished editing, upload them, schedule them, and then read a book, and then go to bed. And then tomorrow will be mainly in the packing vlog, which is going to be coming either before or after this. I don't really know when this is going up. So be sure to watch the packing vlog if you want to see other productive things I've done this week. But generally, I feel like this week was actually relatively productive and I've read 8 out of 10 books I've done all of the videos that I wanted to do and I've done all of the other admin bits the only thing that I didn't really do was exercise that much but you live and you learn <laughs> if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a huge thumbs up comment down below any video requests you have by the way because I am a bit stuck for ideas after all the university content goes up and yeah I'll see you very soon with a new video bye guys Mwah.